7 million families live in Beijing. Every morning, millions of people in the city say goodbye for the day. The hurried activities of the commercial world fill the lives of the human residents. But behind in their homes, they have housemates who speak an entirely different language. Once the door is closed and their human roommates are gone, the world inside becomes theirs to do as they please. It takes a special kind of person to live with a husky. To have two huskies may be the sign of a true warrior. Sun Ying has two huskies. The Hachi is the Shang Di Pai, the Mordian Sinji. The Wang Hong, the Tupia, the Tupia, The bulldozing team is taken out for a stroll round the block while the camera team get things set up. This dog owner will get to satisfy her curiosity. The equipment needs to be installed and tested first. There is just enough time and everything is ready. Katie is eight months old and arrived at this home earlier than three-year-old Nika. Normally, younger dogs are more curious than older ones, and Katie has discovered there is something different about the house. The camera is in trouble. Their owner is worried the dogs will be lonely. It doesn't seem to be a problem for Katie, as teeth marks on the furniture clearly show she finds ways to amuse herself. Dogs have a keen sense of smell. They know when strangers have visited. Katie has also discovered a camera behind the cactus. Siberian huskies were bred to haul sleds during the long and cold winters of northern regions. But here, they have no opportunity to get the strenuous exercise they require. In the small confined space of an apartment, they devise their own exercise plans.
Nika hasn't done anything too bad yet, except for relieving herself by the window. It's eight o'clock in the morning. Time for Guo Qi to get up. Like most people in the city, his life involves a series of daily chores and duties. One difference is the three cats that share his home. there are four living beings sharing this 40 square meter apartment. There is cute Chen Zai. Next is Hui Zai, the youngest, and then the gentle Rou Zai. Their human roommate, Guo Qi, is a young single IT worker, full of passion, energy, and refined preferences. Guoji set up a cat cam to check on the secret lives of the three cats. He can check at any time from any place as long as there's an internet connection. Guoji spent more than five months learning coding and studying remote closed circuit TV technology and techniques. All the furniture and electronics here have been laid out according to the size of the place and habits of the cats. This 40 square meter area is the cat's private universe most of the time. Four months ago, these newlyweds took in Manto, a corgi. The new arrival to the family would make life a bit more varied and interesting. Manto's legs are a bit short, but he's full of energy and very healthy. Every time his owner leaves him at home alone, it requires some courage and wits. The corgi is a well-known breed, partly due to it being the favorite dog of Queen Elizabeth in Britain. They are brave and full of passion, or to put it another way, a bit crazy. A check of the rubbish bin is a daily priority. Today's peek into the bin rewards him with a discarded apple. The corgi can be used as a shepherd because of their large mouth and powerful jaws. The apple is easy to eat, but the rubbish bin offers nothing more. Oh. 
Manto tries to relieve himself within the assigned area, but it's not always easy. His years of abuse by others have cast a shadow on him. Manto is fearful of the slightest disturbance. His new owners are very careful to protect his emotional development. As part of Guo Qi's monitoring system, there is also a small remote control device. It can move around to check on things and is operated from a phone or a computer on the internet. It's also equipped with radar avoidance capabilities, plus a docking mechanism for power outages or when it needs to recharge. The creations of a technology enthusiast have not disturbed the cats. For about two years, this system has been watching every corner of the house. Guoqi knows what the cats get up to when he's out. As it turns out, there are no mysterious or amazing occurrences. Everybody 我们家欠的那只猫，它每天吃饭的速度很多，但是它下午四点左右准时会来吃，就是在四点前后误差不到几分钟。Guo's life is also quite methodical. The IT worker will go to work and return, exercise, get takeaway, and dispose of rubbish according to a daily timetable. There are more than 200 apartments in this complex, but while you can hear the pets, they do not interact. More than two years of observation have not been enough for Guo Qi to know for sure whether the cats truly feel lonely when he's gone. The only thing he's learned is the multitude of daily activities they indulge in. Guoqi posted his observations online to the praise of cat lovers and technology enthusiasts who felt he saw interesting things with his unique system.
being separated is one reason, but worry is another cause for not wanting to go to work. When they're left alone, Katie will become very lively in the apartment. Nika isn't terribly interested in Katie's actions, but she can be an accomplice. Nika becomes a bit more nervous and paces around the apartment. Nika is a little girl, she's very strong. 特别敏感，特别谨慎的，反正我觉得他的心灵受伤害了一个，因为他个儿比较小，所以在狗场呢跟那些大狗在一块儿，他也爱欺负。我们第一次去接他的时候，他胆子特别小，就你人靠近都不行。<笑>the owner's shoes can be very helpful in warding off feelings of loneliness when a pet is alone Katie easily finds the camera buried under the cabinet now there is no hiding of the surveillance any longer. Every evening, this city witnesses countless reunions. Tired city dwellers look forward to being reunited with family members after a long and arduous commute to and from work. <laughs> Recently, Guo Qi's cat cam revealed Chen Zai had been eating a bit too much. It seems life for a pet in a big city does not involve a lack of food. It's important for humans and pets living in small spaces to eat properly. Chen Zai is still able to show that despite her weight, she's quite nimble. This kind of unusual animal occasionally shows the affection for you. It's very moving. I don't even know if they're going to take care of me or how they're going to treat me. I just want to be part of my own family. I have to take care of them. But they don't take care of me or how they're going to treat me. They don't take care of me or how they're going to treat me. Although they have unique personalities and are independent, these cats still enjoy the support of their owner. The species has learned how to live with people in their homes and how to project a human-like compassion. I 更多程度上就是说，尽量改善自己和猫的生活质量吧，挺朴素的这种想法。It may be a small apartment, but some additions are permissible. There is a new automatic feeding machine. Guo Qi can use the CCTV and his mobile to help Chen Zai lose some weight. The bigger change is that a new family member has entered the household. The implications are huge for the dynamics at home. It is always a big challenge when the owner is absent. Manteau extends his short legs to probe every nook and cranny. During the day when they're alone, dogs rush to and fro, jump, 
wait, appear to mutter, and think about life. Unlike cats, nearly all dogs wait impatiently. When it's time to be reunited with their owners, it's the happiest moment of a day. I know Another additional joy is the arrival of new friends. His owner wants Manto to meet other pets that might help to bring him out of his shell. The two guests are a black cat and a white one. Manto's feelings about this are complicated. There seems to be some joy at the potential friendship, but a heightened alertness as well. Manto doesn't know how to interact with his new friends. The guests are also at a loss. <laughs> Curiosity and passion are important, but Manto also needs to learn the subtleties of social interaction. It's not an entirely harmonious meeting, but it ends on good terms. The art of walking a dog is essential knowledge for an owner. But if you want to go for a run, you need to pick a good place. Everyone needs someone to listen to them from time to time. Huskies can bark or make sounds to communicate with their owners. The loneliness of the heart is often buried by the stress of everyday life. We may not understand how to avoid it entirely, but if you're surrounded by loved ones, it is enough, even if city life seems like living on a lonely planet. Maturity can be a slowly developing epic or a trivial soap opera. The city is growing, children and young adults are maturing, and of course, so are their pets. These family members are often a source of strife and comfort. Their maturity, speed of development, and potential for disaster can be surprising.